Hello, welcome to the Robin review. I'm Robin Redbreast and this is going to be my first product review video and what product I'm reviewing is the new Galaxy S22 which I've had now for about two months and I'm going to highlight my top five things about the phone that I love. Um, two things I don't love um, but overall this thing is virtually indestructible. Virtually indestructible and you should buy it. So the first thing that made me choose to buy this phone over the Galaxy Ultra, the S22 Ultra, or the Z Flip was the camera. The camera is better on it as well as the storage capacity. Yeah, ultra wide camera on, on the back and a telephoto zoom lens as well. So there's three different cameras in the back and they are spectacular. Um, considering I could easily spend the same amount on a camera just alone. So basically I get a camera with built-in Wi-Fi, which is on 5G. The 5G sucks. Uh, I find that streaming services um, buffer more on the 5G than they do on my 4G phone. The 4G phone, man, it, it never, I never have a problem um, streaming on like on the streaming services like HBO Max or Paramount Plus, but for some reason the 5G, I don't, I don't know why, but it's harder on streaming that I usually end up giving up and putting on, putting on my entertainment on the other phone, which is the opposite reason why I bought this phone. Um, cause I primarily bought this phone to be able to do media stuff on it and be able to do everything else and keep my regular phone together. So camera and then storage capacity it's got eight gigabytes of ram and what was it 128 128 gigs of memory on it that's uh device storage memory plus it will take an sd card which i haven't even put one in there yet so those are the two reasons the number three thing it is indestructible indestructible so here's my story within not even 24 hours of buying the phone. Like I literally went to the store in the morning. I took the kids with me. We went, we bought the phone went to Best Buy. I had, oh, that's right. I hadn't even connected it to the net. Like I hadn't taken it and added a line onto the phone yet. I just had the phone because I bought it from Best Buy and as an unlocked phone so I could take it to my carrier. And I didn't even make it to my carrier. I was like, oh, I'll just do that tomorrow. And I did laundry. I had my kid bring me a load of laundry. Somehow, the phone ended up in the laundry, which made it into the washer. I did not know this until I went to go take the clothes out of the washer. The clothes that had just done, been on like the super extended wash, extra rinse and extra spin. This camera. This phone was one on two. I didn't see it till I got to the very bottom and like all the laundry's out and there's the phone on the bottom of the washer and I saw it and it was screened down and I was just like, oh my God, I hadn't even got a phone number. And I pick it up and there's moisture kind of like inside the case. It was in otter. It's an otter box case that I got for it, but it's not like an underwater case. I mean, it's still open, not a single scratch on the screen. The thing was still on and it never once acted like I dropped it. Like it was wet. It never once glitched. I certainly didn't plug any power into it for like 48 hours. I did put it in rice overnight, but I have waited and I've seen, and I've dropped it a couple times. This thing has not glitched once. I've actually spilled like coffee a little bit on it or whatever. And yeah, and I think I saw this in the commercials or whatever, like it has some kind of water repellent or it's made out of some special glass plastic composite that like repels water. But this is insane. I mean, it didn't just repel water. This thing was submerged in an extra large load of laundry on the super cycle with two rinses and two an extra spin so the galaxy 22 in summary from me still has decks on it 
has great memory, great RAM, great space, great camera, and somehow survived my completely destructive child who normally can destroy anything. And yet, here I am with my phone starting my YouTube channel. So, 10 stars.